thank the sponsor of today's video, Surfshark. So Surfshark is a virtual private network available as an easy to use app and browser extension that basically lets you place your laptop and phone anywhere in the world, allowing you to access the internet as if you're in a different country. This lets you access and unblock websites and content that you might not be able to see, for example. So for everybody that does like the show The Office, here in America, it is no longer available on Netflix, but with Surfshock, you can switch your VPN to the UK where the office is available. You're welcome. It also encrypts your data to add an extra layer of security when you're online to keep all of your personal information safe and your browsing activity hidden. And so my favorite feature about Surfshock VPN is that you can connect and use all of your family devices simultaneously. You can protect as many devices as you'd like at once. So if you are interested, use my code Dompierre to get 83% off plus three extra months free. Surfshark also offers a 30 day money back guarantee so there is no risk to try it out for yourself. The link is in the description box down below and thank you Surfshark. Hello my friends and welcome to the video. So today, today we are filming another cheat day. We are here in Sarasota, Florida and we did go to the one and only 5 Donuts. Now I have not been to 5 in months. It's been quite some time. So very, very excited. So let's just get started. It's gonna be amazing. And first off, we're gonna start with the Cronut. Oh my goodness! Now again, I can't remember the last time I had a Cronut, and that's basically a crime because if y'all know me, every cheat day I was starting off with the Cronut. So here we go. My mouth is watering just thinking about it. Amazing. And drink of choice, we do have the Vegan Power Pro iced oatmeal cookie flavor. Very tasty, very amazing. Um, it is plant based per scoop, 19 grams. Um, no artificial flavors, no artificial colors, no gluten, no soy, no dairy, and it's just amazing. If you didn't want to check it out, the link is in the description. Applies free shipping. Next up, we are going to go for the maple bacon. Again, this is the best maple bacon I've ever had in my entire life. Out of all the donut shops that I've been to, this takes the cake. And also, I was, I was wondering, out of all the donuts you guys see me try from 5.0, since not all of you guys have tried them, um, which donut would you like to try? Like, what's the donut that I always show you guys that like you're like, oh, I can't wait to try that? Comment down below, I would definitely like to know. Um, for me, you guys know my, my top three. Or top four, actually. Um, the Cronut, Cookie Monster, Plant City, and the Maple Bacon. So, and not in any specific order. Those are just my top fours. But comment down below. I'd like to hear um, what you guys would like to try. So, here we go. Maple Bacon. I actually think this might be my favorite. It's hard to say, they're all so good.
Oh, and speaking of donuts, the new Team Big Bite shirts are in stock. This design is really, really cool. It came out awesome. If you guys did want to check them out, they are live on my website. Um, it's the 2021 Team Big Bites design. So um, check them out if you guys are interested. Mm. Oh, and I'm sure you guys are wondering where my lovely girlfriend is. Um, she's back home in uh, Pembroke Pines. She was up here for a week. So we did spend like a almost three weeks together down in Pembroke. And then we came up here for about a week. But uh, she's going to be over there for pretty much the whole month of March. And I'll be over here the whole month of March because the CrossFit Open. Uh, she'll be competing. I'll be competing. And um, yeah, so after the open, I'll definitely go down there and visit. Um, but yeah, very excited for the open and I'm very excited to film more videos with her because you guys seem to really enjoy her just as much as I do. And uh, yeah, she's amazing. She's super sweet and um, I love her. So if you're watching this, I miss you, babe. Te extraño, te veo pronto. Next up, the cookie monster so this is a legendary classic from 5-0 this one's in my top four favorites so uh here we go magic blue frosting oreo crumbles cookie butter and cookie bites Oop. no where have I been? Damn, I've missed this donut. That's crazy. I have one more donut left, but I'm gonna save that for later. Um, I'm feeling pretty satisfied. Um, again, I, I know you guys have seen me eat like six donuts in one sitting, uh, but I am no longer at that level. Like, I don't know how I did that. That was crazy. Um, but three is pretty good for me. Again, five of those donuts are pretty massive. So I do have one more, which I will eat later on. But uh, yeah, that's gonna be it for now. Um, I will be back with some more food shortly. Time to eat, I'm hungry. I've had a very busy morning. So it is 2.50 p.m. right now. Um, I had an appointment to have my wrist looked at. I hurt my wrist a long time ago skateboarding. I broke the scaphoid, this was like 2010. And so it never like proper, well I never properly um, got it worked on to work on the range of motion. You know, as I've joined CrossFit, you know, a lot of the movements are very demanding for like pressing overhead, um, handstand push-ups, handstand walks. Um, so I always have like a little bit of an issue. So I uh, dug in there, I did like some dry needle in and was like pulsing the muscle because over here is super, super tight. So um, I have four more visits, so hopefully it does improve. It already does feel a little bit better. And then I did have a 90 minute massage, which was really nice. I fell asleep twice. So yeah, it's been nice. <laughs> so we did go to McDonald's. For some reason, I just felt like having a Big Mac. And also, I really wanted to try out their new spicy chicken nuggets. I did get their almighty hot sauce as well. So we're gonna give those a try today. 
I want to eat some of these fries because they're going to get cold. They're kind of already cold. And we did get a Coke as well. Ugh. If you're wondering what this meal costs, $11.64. All right, let's dive into this Big Mac. So me and the Big Mac, we go way back. I used to eat this when I was a kid. So again, the Big Mac, um, pretty much everyone knows what Big Mac is, but we do have the Mac sauce, we have lettuce, we have a patty, cheese, another slice of bread, more lettuce, and another patty, and more mac sauce, and more pickles. Well, pickles. There's only one round of pickles on here. But it does have the mac sauce twice, but there's only one slice of cheese. I don't know if that's how it comes standard. Maybe it does, but the Big Mac. Mm. And I swear these things get smaller and smaller because that's crazy. All right, let's try out these spicy chicken nuggets. Let's see what the hype's all about. I mean, I, whoa, that is a big chicken nugget. That is not normal size. Okay, there we go. Yeah, so this is normal size. This is like, <laughs> I thought they were all gonna come in this size, but two, four. Oh, they, well, this is, yeah, it's two in one. So they, they only gave me, it's supposed to be six nuggets, but they counted this as two. All right, here we go. Actually, let me try it first without the almighty sauce. It does have a little bit of a spice to it, not much. But let's see how the, see how it is with this mighty hot sauce. I dig it. It's kind of like a little bit of like Tabasco y. Now we're going to finish off these french fries. Let's actually use some sweet and sour. For these. I got some ketchup, but. The fries with the sweet and sour, that's a great combination. All right, and now time for dessert. So we do have a package from Buckeye Brownies. So these are their limited edition March flavors. We do have Razzle Dazzle and Birthday Bash. Ooh. I can't wait to try this one. Oh, I can't wait to try both of them, but this one's more like a fruity, and it is a blondie base, which I love the blondie bases. Ooh, it's like soft and like falling apart already. Look at that. It's like, cook, it's like cookie dough consistency. All right, so in the Razzle Dazzle, we do have Blondie Base laid with a frosted raspberry pop tart topped with our homemade lemon cake cookie dough infused with an actual raspberry, all topped with our famous graham cracker crumb 
topping. Okay, here we go. Just look at that first. Or actually look at this one first. Here we go. Razzle dazzle. Hmm. Wow. So it has like that raspberry pop top flavor, but it has like a hint of lemon. So it's like a cookie dough, a lemon cookie dough with raspberry pop tots with graham cracker crumbs. All right, last bite, I promise. It just gets better and better though. Like, look at this. Damn. All right, I'm not gonna eat the whole thing because I have a whole another brownie over here. We have that razzle dazzle. I already like it more than this one. <laughs> so next up, this one is called Birthday Bash. So we do have a brownie base laid with birthday cake Oreos topped with our homemade Funfetti cake batter cookie dough infused with a rainbow colored vanilla chips and sprinkles all topped with Funfetti chips, another birthday cake Oreo, and more sprinkles. Look at that, it's so soft that my my fingers were just sinking into it by just, just holding it by its own weight. And again, these brownies are basically half a pound each. So it's like an eight ounce brownie. They're heavy. So, all right, here we go. Birthday bash. It has like a, almost like a cake frosting flavor to it because it has so many Oreos in here. So it's like you're getting a lot of like the the middle of the Oreo flavor. So it's kind of like cake frosting. I definitely like Razzle Dazzle better. But both of them are really tasty. So that is the limited edition March flavors from Buckeye Brownies. If you guys did want to check them out, link will be in the description box down below. You can save 10% with code Team Big Bites. Um, definitely try them out guys. Again, they are limited edition for March only. Razzle Dazzle definitely takes the cake for me. Birthday Bash was good, but that Razzle Dazzle was fire. So definitely check them out. And thank you, Buckeye Brownies. Just another sunny day in Southern California. It's where the people came to play. Don't let them transform ya. Oh. Hey. Come and see what you've been missing on a little slice of heaven. It's the only place we're living. We're living. It's that West Coast point of view. Easy when it's We are back and we have our last and final meal of the day. So, decided to get some Chinese food. It's been quite some time since I've had Chinese food on this channel. And so that's what we got. So, let's check it out. So we went to a place called China Gourmet. This is my first time going there. I did go with a General Sao chicken. Check it out. White rice, broccoli, and General Sao's chicken. It's sweet, it's spicy, and it's amazing. Also, we did get a wonton soup. So the three wontons in there. 
Um, they did come with an egg roll. I believe these are... Uh, like little chips for the wonton soup. And we also did get some beef teriyaki steaks. I love these things. Super tasty. Damn, that's good. Let's dive into the soup here. Mmm. It's funny, the wonton soup reminds me of winter time back home in Massachusetts. I used to get hot wonton soup when it was like snowing, super cold out. And it's just like brought me back to my childhood. Mm. Damn, that just warmed my soul. All right, and now moving on to the General Tso's chicken. Give you guys a little close up here. This stuff is amazing. I think I need a plate. <laughs> Alright. Bon provecho. Oh, by the way, um, let me show you guys what this is. Sangria, senoria, senorio, senorio. So it's like a sparkling, non-alcoholic sangria, natural, artificially flavored. So it's like a, just really tasty, sugary, sparkling, like non-alcoholic sangria. It is amazing. And again, I had it for the first time at my girlfriend's parents' house, and it's damn good. And if I have to be honest about this chicken, it's a lot more batter around like what's supposed to be chicken. It's just like a lot of like general cell batter instead of there being a lot of chicken inside. So it's kind of like just like a lot of fried outside. I think I'm gonna stick with the teriyaki stick and the rice. Mm -hmm. These are amazing though. The rice is still very tasty. So it has like the general style sauce all over it. So it's like a, a sweet white rice. Sweet white rice. Sweet white rice. But yeah, I'm not gonna eat the general styles because I got it so I can get some more protein, but there's not much protein in there.
All right. I'm not gonna eat that general sauce because it's just not that good. So, um, we do have dessert though. <laughs> this was the donut that I did not eat this morning. We do have a s'mores donut from 5.0. So big old yeasted donut with chocolate, marshmallows, graham cracker crumbles, and a marshmallow, and some Hershey's. Oh man. I should have just ate it this morning. <laughs> it's a little dry now. Let's get that marshmallow in there. There we go. That lightened it up a little bit. That is gonna be it for today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy it. So it was a pretty fun, chill cheat day here in Sarasota. And we did get to go to the one and only 50 Donuts. And man, it's been quite some time since I've been there. So um, it was a nice little refresher. And seriously, that maple bacon is in competition with the Cronut for first place. Like those two are like neck and neck, but man, that maple bacon just hit differently today. And it's absolutely phenomenal. But if you guys are ever planning to come to Sarasota, Definitely go to 5.0. I mean, I've had a lot of people that are traveling here and they, they sent me DMs on Instagram saying, hey, I'm gonna go to 5.0 on this day. Do you think you can make it? And uh, most of the time I can make it and uh, we get we can share as a cronut. So that'd be awesome because I seriously feel like everybody needs to try these donuts and see how massive they are because they are just phenomenal. But yeah, overall pretty fun, solid day. Again, I wanna give a big thank you to the sponsor of today's video. Surfshock VPN. Be sure to check them out in the description box down below. And yeah, I think that's gonna be it. So thank you guys so much for the love and the support. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And then on Friday we will...